really important to research the company and the role before you go for interview. Incredibly important, but also incredibly easy. Most companies these days have websites, so go online, check out what the company does, find out about their culture, find out about any awards they've recently won, any expansion plans, any projects that they're currently working on. Um, in addition, if you don't get a lot of information from their websites, you can also look at past newspaper articles or press releases. You can also go on to Facebook pages, Twitter pages, which is also a recent development. Also, you can look at LinkedIn, so look at perhaps the company, find out what people work there. You can have a look at what types of jobs they do, and it gives you a good understanding of perhaps the sort of hierarchy within the company and where your role could potentially sit. When you apply for a job and then also prior to interview for that job, you should always research the company. Um, the internet is a given these days, and you certainly look at the company website, but then remember everybody's going to be doing that. Um, so then take the next step and go further. Try to find out what the company actually does in terms of where, what markets they operate in, what customers they supply to. If you can find anybody who knows about the company, remember Northern Ireland's a small place, so you'll always be able to find somebody who knows somebody who knows somebody who has a friend who works there. So remember that you can uh, ask, ask around, make phone calls, talk to people, and find, try to find out the underlying issues with that company. Maybe some successes they've had recently, maybe something that's coming up in the pipeline for them, maybe the challenges they face, maybe not just their company, but also the wider industry as well. Well, in advance of an interview, an applicant should research the company and the job through several fronts. I mean, first of all, it might, it might sound very simple and basic, but many people overlook it. Make contact with the company. You know, talk to somebody in the marketing department, ask them if they have a marketing pack, do they have information, simple brochures about the organisation, get access to them, make an appointment, call down, collect it, show your face, show your interest, show your eagerness. Who knows, someone on the panel might have picked that up and that goes in your favour. In the day of mass media, there's just so much available online about the company. There's no hiding places. You can do Google News Alerts about a company and you can set that up. If you've got an interview three or four weeks' time, you can, get, you can be fed articles daily and that's pretty useful. Look at the company website, of course, um, what sort of press releases are available through various search engine websites. Um, go online, look at their competitors, see if there's any industry trends available from third-party directories, etc. Um, get copies of trade directories if it's relevant to a certain industry. Um, make contact with an umbrella organisation, say for example Momentum, look after all the IT companies in Northern Ireland. They might have lots of information about the company, the industry, the trends, etc. One of the most important things before you even attend an interview is to make sure that you do your research. Um, key area would be obviously to read the job description. Um, that will have 99.9% uh, .9 of the information that's needed um, in order for you to, to do a good interview. If you're working with a recruitment business, that's a real advantage um, because it's their job to make sure that you're fully prepared and that you have the supplementary information that's going to make you come across as being really eager, enthusiastic, well informed. What I would say as well is you need to be researching the organisation to show the organisation that you are interested in them. Tell them about things that you find out. You know, have they got a good reputation in the HR department? Do they have excellent relationships with the community? Don't be afraid to, if you like, give them a bit of flattery. Show them you're interested in working for them. 